FD. <clears throat> Fed poised for marked rise as Yellen departs. So it sounds like that's when they plan for the global financial crash then, because as soon as they start raising the interest rates, everything's going to go boom within a couple, matter of two or three months. Everyone's going to be basically on the streets because they're not going to be able to afford to pay the mortgages. But <clears throat> it's planned. It's all pre-planned. <clears throat> Um, so, well, you've been warned. Capita share plunge raises fresh concerns over state contractors. Almost one billion wiped from market cap. Chief admits outsourcer is far too complex. Capita, the, the biggest corporation on the planet that most have never heard of that runs pretty much the planet. By that, it's run by the, the likes of the Rothschilds and the Catholic Church, the Vatican. <clears throat> Our government's pretty much a toothless moron that just follows the rules or what orders are sent passed down to them, so <clears throat> don't worry about that. The Guardian. <clears throat> MPs vote to leave Westminster for urgent six-year restoration. Relocation of Parliament will be first since Luftwaffe bomb destroyed Commons in 1941. It's a shame they weren't all inside. Uh, oh, no, no, that, that bit, I just had it. <clears throat> now, this is fake news. What this is about, they know that everyone's had enough. And when the revolt comes, they're going to be hiding. You're not going to be able to go to Westminster and find them and drag them out and... Do, do whatever is needed to be done with them they'll all be hiding but fortunately we know where they live so they won't be able to hide anywhere come the, the time when everything's going to be sorted that's what that's about though they're doing a runner because they know this shit's about to hit the fan capita shares plunge amid fears over new carillion Nothing happens by accident. It's all planned months and years and decades in advance. Although they are getting a little twitchy at the moment because all their well-laid plans are, start, are being exposed and they're starting to have a little bit of a squeaky bum because they know the shit is certainly on its way. BBC. Boss has lied to me, Gracie tells MP. Carrie Grace, the former China editor at the BBC yesterday, said management at the corporation was incapable of re resolving its gender pay crisis and needed external help. Yes, it needs shutting down, the heads need locking up for, for crimes against humanity because the propaganda they've been putting out is at the worst propaganda I've seen ever. Wouldn't mind if it was decent, but it's not very good. The long read, how the Mafia infiltrated Italy's asylum system. The maf Mafia is controlled by the government, controlled by the Rothschilds, con controlled by the Vatican. They're all, it's all controlled. So, but of course they've got to have you think there's a, a, a goodie and a baddie, because then, fight, oh yeah. Oh, he's, he's good, oh, he's bad. That's how it works. You would top, if you're anywhere sort of like, my age, about 36, you were taught at school, divide and conquer. I doubt they're being taught that now because they don't want us to know what the crack is. The scum. Ants Mrs. lines up brief some tough divorce lawyer. Formula dumb. Now kill Joy's Bang Grand Prix grid girls. The way they're going after all this is, is again shows us an agenda behind it. What that agenda is, I can sort of see, but I'm not going to have a bash until I'm 100% on it. And of course, you've got Lewis Hamilton, the satanic uh, Formula One champion, and um, Satanist. Daily fail. <clears throat> Women who say we all have the right to one last love affair. Uh, as heavy drinking becomes sixth biggest cause of serious illness among baby boomer generation, alarming toll of wine o'clock. 
and all those who were in the 50s and 60s sort of thing apparently they hit <coughs> they're hitting the, the pop a little bit too much because because they know what's going on is corrupt and they don't know how to deal with it so they get out of this planet by getting shit faced that's it that's what it's about they can't handle the crap that's going on so they get shit faced i can't fault them to be fair child sex shame of harpist who played for the queen pages six and seven now because it's pedo stuff <clears throat> put a little bit on the front and then shoved it to the back because they don't want you lot knowing that virtually everyone that's involved with the queen is a pedophile star football distraction the big part in the middle distraction at the side distraction but i'll go over some of it for you bgt stars acid attack threat security increase for cal and co don't believe that for a second although he's a satanist and a freemason they go hand in hand if you're a freemason you're a satanist then vice versa Aunt and Lisa are reunited. Basically, she's gone to work in the Palladium where he. Uh, where they, they, they just. How they find these storylines is just ridiculous. F1 Axis, Glamour Girl, Grid Girls. So, sport distraction, TV distraction, TV distraction, sport distraction. The Times, The Dark Side of Paris, Corruption, Violence and a TV Smash Hit. That's probably the real side of Paris to be fair. MPs quit Palace of Westminster for first time since the Blitz. Well I told you earlier what that's about, they're doing a runner because they know that shit is just about to impact the fan. They don't want to be anywhere near where they can be get got hold of when it does that's what that's about like i said we all know where where they all live i know where my pedo mp although he's not really because i'm not on the voters register but I, i'm in his constituency um kenny clark we know where he lives not that far from us i look forward to the day he's dragged out and made to face the consequence of his evil crime again another satanist Extremists use schools to pervert education. <clears throat> British values undermined, warns Ofsted chief. Yes, I, I totally agree. Extremists do use schools to pervert education. Those extremists being the government. There's no more extremists than the government. The biggest extremist on the planet is every government. Government to control the mind. Putin contact fights ex-wife over 450 million, 3 million divorce order. You've got that much money, that means he's got at least that much, I would imagine, himself. So just, just chill out and get on with it. It's not like you could ever spend it, but it's not about spending the money. It's about keeping it from the, the rest of us. That's what it's really about. Daily Mirror. Sport distraction. 10 ads that drive you mad distraction parents plead to judge please don't switch off our boys life support heartbroken mum and dad last ditch bid to save 20 month old son this shows that you do not own your kids the state have claimed them the kids are there to do with as they see fit if they want to switch off the machine and kill him they will do just that when are you going to get your kids have been stolen and it's only the fact they've not got round to you that they've not taken your children to be sent to the satanist paedophile rings daily express <clears throat> tempe at last may gets tough on migrants apparently we We've been told by the EU, because, you know, as you know, we're leaving that. We're leaving the EU. Oh, wait. Oh, no, that's just smoke and mirrors. 
uh, Parrot, we've been told we've got to keep ex uh, our borders open, keep accepting immigrants uh, until 2021. So we're not leaving the EU. And by 2021, if the shit hasn't hit the fan by then, it'll become obvious that we haven't left the EU because we'll be so embroiled in it. And we've already got foreign troops on this sovereign land. So everyone in Parliament have committed treason. That's why they're doing a runner. Now Formula One girls are banned. PC culture is driving the world mad. Don't think so. Don't think so. Not driving me mad. I'm already mad, as many will tell you. Telegraph. <clears throat> BBC, <coughs> BBC women on the march. <clears throat> Obviously, <clears throat> this is for fair pay. You know, if <clears throat> you do a job and someone else comes along and does a job, the same job, you should both get paid the same amount of money. It doesn't matter if you're a man or a woman or a kid, an 18 year old, 17 year old, 16 year old, you should get the same amount of money for doing the same job. But the system set up to corrupt everyone. The youngest get paid the lowest, and men apparently get paid more than women. So, according to the BBC, at any rate, <clears throat> Capita fears draw Carillion comparisons. Yeah, both been given trillion pound um, contracts by a corrupt criminal government. That just carry on because you know what are you gonna do <coughs> and where are you gonna find them <coughs> corporations accused of lying about pay equality as it is dragged into worst crisis since Savile well you know that's the BBC for you <coughs> shock no and there's more to come out about all the pedos in there as well again if they're paedophiles they're usually Satanists as well Alexa generation in for rude awakening. Now, <clears throat> I know some that use this sort of thing. It's where Alexa, put the kettle on. Alexa, what's the time? Alexa this, Alexa that. So they actually got a, a box of technology to do the thinking for them. So yeah, they're going to be in for a rude awakening. When the grid goes down and none of that shit works, they're going to be totally clueless as to what to do. And they won't have prepared, so there's going to be a shock for them. But... Sometimes the hardest lessons are the ones most needed. Church criticised over fresh Bishop Bell claim. Now apparently the Church of England has um, released some documents that another kid has been raped by the paedophile priests. Hey, apparently they criticised over doing it, for releasing that information. Oh yeah, because you've attracted it back to us. Well, you hadn't done it in the first place. And back to the Beeb, out of touch with reality, but the Beeb keep digging. Of course they do. <laughs> they think they're indestructible. They're such a big corporation that many of you fund. You're funding a paedophile, satanic propaganda organisation. Just think about that. You are, are, are paying for our, your own demise. Aye, paper. Quality, concise, the future of independent journalism. Every time I read that, I crack up because it's just lies. <coughs> and sexist BBC pay. Parliament hears explosive testimony from top correspondent. Wow. Maybe they're going to get their bum spanked. Oh, and, and in the budget, the TV licence has gone up again. Diners Beware revealed how plastic waste passes through the food chain. Football. Main headline. Stroke warning for over 40s. That's you. That's you. Um, <coughs> I'm 36, so I'm okay. <coughs> 
Record number of people aged 40 to 69 are having strokes. Weight, heavy drinking and lack of exercise behind increase. Younger adults urge to change lifestyles and learn symptoms. One in six people will have a stroke in their lifetime. Eat the right food. Drink the right drink. Um, distilled water with a little bit of pink Himalayan salt added just to take its pH up a bit. Um, and it won't happen to you. But the way the system's set up, you only get to eat crap food with no nutrients or minerals in it, which means your body is scavenging for energy and it usually does that by eating away at your bone marrow. And that's what's happening to the majority of us. Dog's dinner. Is it safe for f to feed your pet raw meat? Well, let me think about it. I wonder what happened when they were out and they weren't domesticated. Oh, they ate raw, fresh meat. What a shock. And they survived. Well, blow me down. You could have knocked me over with a feather. I'll tell you what, though. What's not safe to eat for dogs is dog food. That crap they put in the can. That is absolutely no good for dogs whatsoever. But what can you do? And as for the biscuits... <clears throat> down the bottom there I wanted to hide away Joel Domet's comeback from online sex shame yeah I don't know who that is May in China Beijing opens up stand up to lose weight okay start a life's adventure an extract from Chris Packham's award winning memoir Okay, you can write something now and then you issue yourself with an award. That's how it works, isn't it? Metro. Formula One scraps the grid girls. Wheelchair fraudster, 500k scam. Cheat pretended to be paralysed for 15 years so he could claim benefits. This, I believe, is fake news and they're going after the... The, the disabled again that's all this is about because they're trying to get you know, the, the, anyone that's got disabled is a, a scammer that's why majority of the six scum in parliament voted to cut money while their expenses go through the roof you know we're cutting 20 30 quid a week off someone that can hardly afford to live anyway oh by the way i'm spending five hundred thousand pounds doing my house up on expenses because i can <clears throat> that's how it is